What is up my fellow germaphobes? So, Rogue One teaser trailer finally dropped today, and I'm going to go ahead and check this out. Let's do this. Yeah. I don't know why I'm like State your name for the record. Jen Arthur. Forgery of Imperial documents. Possession of stolen property. Aggravated assault. Resisting arrest. On your own from the age of 15. Reckless, aggressive, and undisciplined. This is a rebellion, isn't it? That was my mother. I rebel. Is that the same actress? It can't be, right? We have a mission for you. A major weapons test is imminent. We need to know what it is and how to destroy it. Is that clear? Dude. Yes, sir. What the heck is that? It all looks the same as you. It looks the same as the original trilogy, but like modern. What will you do if they break you? If you continue to fight. On like a beach or something? What will you become? The heck? She was like. I'm guessing she was disguised? That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I'm not sure if I want to watch this movie, though, because I can't help but feel like Star Wars is getting milked. You know what I mean? I'm, like, I feel like it's going to lose its magical touch after a while, because if they're coming out with a Star Wars every year now, it's going to become, like, a yearly routine, just like with the Marvel movies. You know what I mean? I mean, Star Wars movies are usually rare and thus it's a magical experience the hype builds up and you go to see it but now it's going to be year round i don't know if, whether to take that as a good thing or a bad thing that's just a concern of mine but i don't know i mean there's still hype over the marvel movies even though there's two a year uh, shut up phone. so um i don't know maybe with star wars it'll still keep its magical feeling i don't know but um that aside the trailer looks pretty awesome i mean so we're seeing the death star again we see it getting built, you know, that cannon coming in. It's so cool. It's just like the original trilogy, only it has, like, modern effects. I hope they keep continuity in this movie. Like, everything looks the exact same as it did in Episode 4, as far as the Death Stars, Star Destroyers, Stormtroopers, etc. You know, I'm hoping that they keep good continuity here. But, you know, the effects will obviously be more modernized. That's what I'm hoping, anyway. Like, that that's one concern I have for, like, the Han Solo m movie coming up. If they are doing that, it's like Harrison Ford isn't that age anymore. So what the heck are they going to do? You know, they have to, t has to take place, like, years before, right? But anyway. Yeah, this looks cool. Um, I think the Death Star was built at Geonosis, but was moved or something. That would be awesome. Uh... If one of the characters from the Rebels show up, made an appearance in this movie, don't you think that'd be cool? Because it's Rebels is only a few years before um, Episode 4. And then this movie takes place right before Episode 4. You know, these are about the Rebels that take the Death Star plans. We're finally getting to see what happened there. So that's pretty cool. I might just have to check this movie out. Um, but yeah, I, I can tell that's Moth Mothma though, uh, Mon, Mon Mothma, it looks like it might be a different actress, but I hope they keep, like I said, I hope they keep continuity, at least like, have her look like her, you know what I mean, which she does, she does look like a little bit younger version, because I think uh, Return of the Jedi takes place maybe four or so years later, so... Not that that's really a big age difference, but... But yeah, this looks awesome. Um, this is when the Empire was still in effect, and we still see Imperial Stormtroopers, so... 
if the Force Awakens didn't give you a nostalgia, this will. <laughs> but, um, yeah, anyway, what do you guys think about all this? Comment below. I'll leave a link in the description below for you to check this teaser out for yourself, as well as to my social media and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, may the Force be with you all, and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye. That is blasphemy. I, I apologize.